In this video, we're going to walk you through how you can download and install GTA 5 on your laptop or PC. If you find this guide helpful, please consider subscribing and liking the video. It really helps out the channel. GTA 5 is an exciting action adventure game with both a single player story and a multiplayer mode. You can also play solo or team up with friends and there's tons of things to explore and do in this game. Plus, GTA 6 might actually be finally coming out next year, so you might as well catch up on GTA 5. To get started, simply open up a web browser of your choice. I'm going to use Chrome for this, but any web browser works, and search for Steam. Go ahead and hit enter, and click on the first link up at the very top that says Welcome to Steam. From here, you'll see an option that does say Install Steam. Go ahead and click on that, and then it'll take you to another page that prompts you to install Steam again. Click on this thing and then open up the Steam setup file to start the installation process and follow the prompts just like any other app. When the installation is complete, launch Steam and it should look something like this. What you're gonna wanna do on this page right here is simply log in if you haven't already. Once you're logged in, go to the store tab up in the top left and go ahead and click on it and then find the search bar right here and type in GTA. Go ahead and hit enter and you'll see a bunch of different options just like so. You're going to want to be looking for the Grand Theft Auto 5 enhanced version and open this up just like so. And what you're going to want to do on this page is simply go ahead and find it and hit add to cart and then hit view my cart. From here, you can continue to a payment, purchase it, do whatever you need to do. And then after buying it, go ahead and head to the library tab. I'm going to use Grand Theft Auto 4 as an example, but you're going to want to find it in this section and then hit install. Wait for it to install and then hit play. Now you will see that you'll have a GTA 5 legacy version, which is going to be the original one. And then also a GTA 5 enhanced version, which is the newest version. Choose whatever one you prefer and just make sure you install that one and play that one. But yeah, when it's done, simply hit play and you'll be good to go playing GTA 5. Now you can also get it through the Epic Games launcher. That's what I did with this one because I ended up getting it for free. So just keep that in mind. If you have any questions, let us know down in the comments below and remember to like and subscribe.